Hey, Twiggy! I'm back from... Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! Just a, just a little cold there. <laughs> I didn't consider where my portal would open up. <clears throat> but look, boy. I got presents for all my friends. I finished my shopping. Nom, nom. Yep. I got everyone the perfect gift. See? I even got one for Fiora. I got one for Thespio and Midnight Sonata. I got one for Uncle Jasper and Voice. I got presents for Chuggle and Solar. I even got one for Aeon. See? <laughs> Yes, sir! I got everyone a present! <laughs> oh, what's the matter, boy? You think I forgot about you? Oh, you silly rainbow blob! I would never forget you! <sighs> Glad you like it, boy! Now then, I just need to check my list of friends to make sure I got everything and I should be good to go before I head for the Secret Rift Christmas party in a few hours. Whoa, whoa, what? I, I don't have a present for Doc? But, but I got Silver Quill, Golden Fox, Finn, Matt Munchkin. <laughs> How? How could this happen? How could I miss Doc? No! <sighs> We're not flipping out this time. Come on, Lightning, relax. You know Dog just as well as every pony else. Surely you can think of a perfect gift for him? Oh, how about a rainbow in a jar? Uh, no, wait, already did that. Um, oh, how about a reservation picnic? Uh, no, wait, no, I, I did that for his birthday. Oh, maybe some sweets? Yeah. No, no, no! Doc isn't even that big of a sweet tooth, Blissy! You know this! Ugh. Surely there's got to be something I'm overlooking! Think, 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 think! <gasps> Light bulb! Maybe I need to go back to the market and search! Something is bound to catch my eye to inspire the perfect gift for him! Come on, Blissy! Let's do this! I've searched everywhere. <sighs> nothing, <sighs> nothing feels right to give as a present for the pupper. <sighs> he doesn't, he doesn't care for sweets. He doesn't like to be too distracted by video games. And buying the How to Train Your Dragon series, I feel, will just lead to more frowns than smiles. <sighs> I thought I knew Doc well enough to get him something he would like. Light bulb again! Oh, sweet light bulbs, don't fail me now! If I can't think of something to get him, then I'll go ask someone who knows him a lot longer than me! Brilliant! Later. Doc, and I've been up and down everywhere trying to look, and I'm really, really tired. So you see, Brand, I gotta find Doc a present. I've literally been teleporting and flying all up and down Ponyville, and still haven't found anything. My poor wings are sore. <laughs> gotta help me! Oh, no, 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 no. First things first. How did you get in here, Blessicorn? I thought we had spells up against teleportation. 
Why? Because you don't want anybody else breaking into the base again. Is that why you haven't posted a video in a while? She has a point. I've been meaning to speak with you about relaxing the restrictions, but the wedding and honeymoon distracted me and... <clears throat> but I digress. Miss Blissey, you broke into our base unannounced, you didn't make an appointment, and started rambling on about presents for the bestest wolf ever! <laughs> and interrupted our break time. What do you have to say for yourself? Mm -hmm. Well, I know it's early, but if this will make up for what I did and get you to help me, I hope you like it. Um, yeah, honey. Uh, <laughs> totally. <sighs> Alright, look, Bliss. Doc isn't really one about gifts. He's more of a... Well, he likes books. He loves history a lot. Maybe a copy of the Tale of Two Sisters? Oh, or maybe a copy of a D&D 4 game. Maybe he can learn to be a dungeon master. Maybe a box of dog treats? Or is that racist? <laughs> Firebrand! Oh, Perhaps a new pocket watch with an engraving on the inside? Something meaningful. Or maybe a brand new vest. Oh, I know. Love and Respect by Dr. Emeryn Egerix. He'd love that. It was wonderful for us. Or maybe new glasses or... I can always give him one of my Grandma Moss's paintings she made. New couch? He likes art, right? Spa service? It's a cute little cabin in the woods. He should like that. Maybe get artwork conditioned of it or draw it himself? Yeah! She takes gift giving way too seriously. Whoa! Hello, Bliss! Teleporting right onto my nose? That's some impressive precision. Huh? Oh! Dragon Bro! Oh, sweet Celestia, thank you! If anyone can help me, it's you! Yeah, yeah, sure thing, Bliss. What can I do for you? I'm trying to find the perfect present for your brother, actually. You think you can give me some tips? Nah, Bliss. You don't have to get Doc anything. He's not that kind of wolf. Come again? He's kind of a picky shopper. Besides, he'll like whatever you get for him. Trust me. But I want it to be special, t -Rack. I don't want it to be just any old gift. Everything I get from one of my friends is something I know they want, or I know they will need or use in the future. Doc has... I can't seem to... I can't think of anything he would want or need! Ugh. I'm just so frustrated, I feel like I could breathe fire! Ha! You breathe fire. Awesome. Now, perhaps you're just overthinking this, Bliss. Oh. God, stupid brain think! Hey, hey, whoa, 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 you're gonna give yourself a headache if you think too hard. You know what? It's really nice to see he's got friends like you who are thinking about him so much. But I think the last thing he would want to see is our little alicorn sister stressing out like this. <sighs> you know, maybe you want to go talk to... It's too late now! I gotta go! The party's gonna start in a few minutes. Ugh. Sorry to bother you, Tarek. Bye! Uh, to him. Uh. Hmm? Ooh, what's this? Oh, a recipe for her peanut butter blossoms! Oh my gosh! Thank you, Blizzy! Quite the turnout, I must say. Looks like the gang's all here. Yep, and there are the brands walking in. And the Acharkis. And there are the Sonatas. Glad to see everyone is here. Hmm. Where's Miss Bliss? And Sub-Zero? Oh, uh... W uh... Hmm? Oh, there they are. Good eye, my lady. I best go say hi to them before they get too caught up in gift giving. 
Happy holidays, Miss Blaze. <gasps> uh, Doc! You're, you're, you're here! Well, of course I'd be. I couldn't miss the festivities. I'd say the decorations are quite nice this year. But don't you think? Um... Mm. I see you've been quite busy with buying presents for friends as well. Hello, Sub-Zero. <laughs> so, how goes the party for you? Seems a lot of our friends are quite happy with the gifts you gave them. I, um... Yeah, I... I... I guess so. Um... Is... Something wrong, Blizzy? Oh, I forgot to give Lady her present! Hmm. <laughs> 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 what? Well, um... Well, thank you for thinking of her, Blissy. Yeah, um... <laughs> welcome! <laughs> Lightning? What's wrong? N -n Nothing's wrong? Why would you ask? Um, um... Um, uh... I think Firebird is calling you, Doc! No, I'm not! She's diverting! Uh-huh. Oh, come now, Miss Bliss. You can always talk to me about anything upsetting you. Doc, surely there is another pony and more stressed than me! I'm fine! No pony is upset here but you. All of our friends are enjoying themselves, but you seem to be the only one stressing out right now. Maybe you're seeing things! I don't think I am. I was playing tricks! You're shouting, and your wings are molting. I see. Well, I'll leave you alone then, Miss Bliss. Wait! Wait! Wait, please! Hmm? You're right. I'm... I am upset. I'm... I'm a terrible friend, Doc. The thing is... I have no present to give you on this holiday. I mean, with all my heart that I've searched up and down, asking your loved ones and friends, looking at stores and shops. I don't know why I was able to find a present for all of our friends and yet somehow lose track of the time and not find something for you, and it's not right. The, the reason why I couldn't find you a gift is simply because I feel like nothing I could give you would ever express how much I appreciate you as a friend. And an older wolf bro. When I first met you, it was for collab idea because you seemed so easy to approach. Then I realized how much other beings looked up to you and even appreciated you that I didn't feel worthy to even ask you for advice or help on things. So I kept my distance. I heard and watched the tales of your good deeds you dumped for others, taking some inspiration in what you do. Then one day you reached out to me and offered me a session in your office then a place on the TF2 team, and before long we were seeing each other at conventions, getting together for vacation breaks, and all the adventures we had, Doc. <laughs> Every time you helped me resolve my anxieties and stresses, encouraged me to reach higher, and always showed me encouragement in everything I did, I could feel my magic grow in inspiration. The colors of my mane are brighter, my confidence stronger than it ever was before, you're the reason why I made it the spar in my work, my channel, and as a better pony. Because of you, I'm able to hold my head higher. And even when things got dark, or cold and scary, when I was at my lowest point, you never lost your resolve and willingness to pick me up and serve, to help me see the light in the darkest of places. If that wasn't enough, you inspire me to get better in my artwork and social skills, to go out and inspire others, help and serve them, just like you've done for so many. You, Doc. You made me better in my confidence, a better YouTuber, a, a better person. I'm sorry for being so dismissive before, Doc. <laughs> I wanted to find you a present to show how much you mean to me, to help represent all of what I stated here tonight. You are the greatest wolf I ever had the privilege to know. Your kindness and sacrifice to others, to help and serve, to have a smile on your face and a kind heart. Of all my friends, you deserve a present just as much as any of us, but I couldn't find you anything. I failed to do so. I couldn't show you the smallest bit of gratitude by finding you a present for Christmas. And 
I'm... I'm so sorry, Will, bro. <laughs> I don't care if I get any gifts or sweets at all this Christmas. <laughs> I just... I just wanted to make you happy. Just as much as you've done for me. Thank you so very much for your kind words, Blissey. You have no idea how great a difference it makes. It may sound surprising, especially considering how so many other ponies love to receive physical gifts during the holiday season, but knowing that I've had such a positive impact in the life of another really does more for me than anything you could wrap in a bow. Genuine words of affirmation from a good friend is all I need to lift my spirits. So, whilst I am sorry to have caused you any stress trying to figure out a gift you could buy for me, I'll remember your kindness here for a long time yet. <laughs> See? I told you. Shut it, dragon! <laughs>